Grand Old Partisan celebrates more than 16 decades of Republican heroes and heroics. Today, I honor Frederick Frelinghuysen, born August 4, 1817. He was delegate to the 1860 Republican National Convention and then served as New Jersey's Attorney General during the Civil War. In 1866, he was appointed to fill a vacancy in the U.S. Senate. Two years later, he turned down President Ulysses Grant's offer to be ambassador to Britain. Instead, in 1871, Frelinghuysen contended for and won another term in the U.S. Senate. Senator Frelinghuysen strongly backed the GOP's civil rights agenda and voted to impeach Democrat President Andrew Johnson. As a member of the 1877 Electoral Commission, he voted to recognize the victory of Republican nominee Rutherford Hayes. President Chester Arthur named him Secretary of State. Frelinghuysen was a member of New Jersey's foremost political dynasty. His grandfather and his uncle had been U.S. Senators. Great-grandson Peter Frelinghuysen served 11 terms in the U.S. House of Representatives, and great-great-grandson Rodney Frelinghuysen served 12 terms. Back to basics for the Republican Party is my civil rights history of the GOP. To quote the book, the more we Republicans know about the history of our party, the more the Democrats will worry about the future of theirs. For more information, see grandoldpartisan.com.